Hey everybody, the Rock Egger here with Daisy. And today we're at Saddle Mountain. See y'all at the dig site. It's a little chilly up here, but I made it to Saddle Mountain and uh, already started finding a couple uh, pieces of petrified wood here. So I'm gonna start digging in this spot because it seems to have a lot of good materials. Just finding these on the ground. There's another piece, another piece. Let's see. That looks like, yep. All right. Let's see if we can find one more. Oh, hey, look at that. Nice chunker of some blonde. And that one might be UV reactive. It's got a little bit of that kind of, looks like petroidal or chalcedony. Filming with a new camera today, so we'll see how this does. This petrified wood's gonna look more like a stick rather than all the round rocks, so. One thing to look out for is when you see something that looks like a, a little piece of a stick or a limb cast, that's probably petrified wood. All right, well, I think we just found a uh, nice piece of wood right here. That definitely is petrified wood and feels like a big piece. So let's go ahead and get this ready to pull out. <laughs> Geo hammer here and get under it. Daisy, it's okay. This is dirt bikers. This might be one of the bigger pieces I've found so far up here. I say that every trip. Oh, there it is. All right, let's get this loose. Wow. Holy crap, that is a big chunk of petrified wood. A new Palmer, let's get this cleaned off. Wow. Hey, let's see uh, what, what this thing looks like. Wow. Yeah, I'll go ahead and get this cleaned off once we get back to the shop. But uh, wow, it's got some beautiful orange yellows, blacks. Probably has that nice root beer color on it. <laughs> Most of the stuff out here does, but. A couple of the faces cleaned off, and wow. Where there's one, there's more. I'm gonna go ahead and continue digging in this spot and kind of go back in that direction at that same level because that seems to be where I'm finding everything is about maybe a foot underneath this topsoil. So yeah, keep digging. So these are some of my favorite pieces out here and they tumble up really nice. He's made a really cool project, that wind chimes that I just did. And yeah, hopefully I find more of them enough to make some more. All right, and as I open up this hole a little bit, I had this one sticking out. That one's got a nice, cool, uh, almost looks like a rainbow trout or something. I don't know. It's got some cool colors to it. Just found this nice little wood knot. Wood knot. Well, limb cast, whatever. I like to call them a wood knot because it's like a knot. All right, so we're about at the end of the trip, and Daisy and I are going to go for a little walk and just try and find some surface finds. Might as well, because uh, it's easy to do out here, especially after it rains. You wander around over here enough, lucky to stumble upon a couple pieces of petrified wood without even having to dig. Let's see. Hey, there's one. It's not a bad piece either. Good size chunk. Dun 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 dun. Is that one? No. Oh, but that's one right there. A little root beer. Looks like there's a few other pieces just sitting right on top here. It's always worth it to kind of go through the tailings of some other spots if there's nobody around. Might as well, right? All right, let's keep going, Daisy. Go find me some petrified wood.
Well, Daisy had a fun day. Still having a fun day. Well, just heading back home and we're gonna go ahead and get everything cleaned off and uh, we'll show you what we found. Rocks. So another thing about uh, this time of year, uh, the wind is a little bit kicked up, so I went ahead and left a little bit early because I saw that rain was in the forecast later and a gusty wind, so it's pretty dusty up here. And if you have allergies and are really, you know, not tolerant of dust well, um, maybe bring a mask. Daisy still wants to play. She's tucking her head out the window. Yeah, get it Daisy. We're gonna hit the highway soon. I think that cleaned up pretty good. Dang. All right, so one other cool thing about this petrified wood, check this out. Let me turn the light off. Some of this is UV reactive. So I got a shortwave UV light and it's picking up the stuff that is glowing orange. It's cool stuff. Neat.